all right guys so we are um uploading our next video i went walking and that should be ready soon so um as you can see i went walking this is the crystallizing form that i was telling you about right here um i just came in from walking so i'm tired i'm allowing my body to cool down i'm putting um liquids back in it i hope you guys went walking with me as well but if not, we'll I'll get you guys straightened out where you'll be walking with me. But um, we are on part four now. We've been through the shampooing phase. We've been through the conditioning phase. We've been through the adding product, which I have product right now, and the crystallizing phase, which we are at right now. Do you see how those curls are crystallized? This is the part where I told you that... Um, you want to put the product in and you don't want to disturb the curls. The curls are going to crystallize. They are going to form crystals individually on them. And then you are going to be able to style the hair. This, what's, it, this is what eliminates frizz. So do we see all of those pretty crystals on the hair right there? So my hair is not as dry as I would have liked for it to got, but... Today wasn't one of those hot, hot, hot days, but it did enough. Remember I told you when you first apply, the product is going to be white. But make sure you don't want to apply, you don't apply a lot. You just want to make sure you got those ends in there. And um, you want to make sure that the hair is well oiled. You want to make sure that the hair is uh, well moisturized. But, um... The crystals is what we're looking for. We we have an undisturbed curl pattern in here. So uh, this is going to be um, my last conclusion. This is styling the hair. Now, keep in mind um, that in the natural world, there are um, different terms of hair. So you will have uh, natural one-day hair, natural two-day hair, natural three-day hair, natural four-day hair. And let me break that down to you. So, um, on, uh, when you freshly wash your hair and condition, basically, uh, one day hair is kind of like, <laughs> um, food when you first cook it, you know, um, you make spaghetti or you make neck bones and greens or you make a, a seafood, um, a, a seafood boil, whatever you make, do you ever notice like when you make it? It tastes good for that day, but uh, the next day it tastes better, and the third day it tastes better. That's because you have allowed all those seasonings. When you put the food back in the refrigerator, you have allowed um, all of those seasonings to soak and, and to saturate. Well, the hair is the same way. Um, when you put product on it, um, it has to get in there and soak, and it has to build up. So the first day... Um, you aren't going to get the results that you really want because the hair is, is building onto that product because keep in mind when we shampoo and we condition, um, we stripped a lot of the moisture out of the hair and then we turned around and put the moisture back into the hair. So when I go to bed at night, um, like right now my hair, it, it looks drawn up. But on day two, it's going to get bigger than what it was uh, on day one. On th day three, it's going to get bigger than what it was on day two. So day four is going to get bigger than what it was on day three. So that's how the natural um, hair world works. So I am not going to talk your head off. Our hair it has finally crystallized. You can see the crystals in my hair. Now what we're going to do, now like I said, my hair is not as dry as a, is as I would have liked for it to gotten, but at the same time, um, it's enough where it, it's dry enough to where it won't create frizz and I can go in here and show you, um, you know, the, fi the final touch after the crystallizing. So what we are going to do is we're going to break the crystals off of the hair and we are going to start forming the hair. Now, um, a lot of people do things different. Um, some people, when they break the, the cast off, what they do is they start from the root. And they just start lifting that hair and they don't go all the way out. Now, um, they don't go all the way out to their ends. 
Now, with me, I like to go all the way out to my ends or whatever. See, this is where the magic starts. Because we are breaking those crystals up now. Sometimes I might, you know, just pick it and not go all the way to the ends and catch the ends, you know, the next day. But um, I like to comb all the way through my hair because if I don't comb all the way through my hair, then I am subject to get those knots. You see what I'm saying? But, I mean, the knots won't form overnight. But I'm just saying, you know, I, I kind of like to go ahead and do that because I, I know once I go to sleep, you know, the product is going to start forming into my hair. And what I'm going to do now, I'm going to, you know, lay that piece down right there that I had. I mean, those taper parts. I'm going to brush those out or whatever and kind of, you know, go through on my edges and you can come out if you want to, you know, or you could take that this way. Just, I, you know, this is just how I wear my hair. And my hair is it's kind of weird. I have weird hair like I have cowlicks. Even though I have natural hair, I still have like cowlicks and stuff in my hair to where my hair looks spiky or my hair looks curly like whatever occasion I'm going to for some reason uh, my hair always matches the theme but this is the comb out we are going in breaking the crystals up off of the hair and like I said um when you get up the next morning the hair will be bigger because and it will look better because the products have soaked. But this is where we are, guys. That hair is moisturized. That hair is crystallized. It is not frizzy. You see what I'm saying? It's beautiful. And this is how you completely take care of your natural hair. And remember, we put the gel in there. So the gel is giving me a lot of definition. So... If I wanted to, you know, I could wear my hair multiple ways. If I wanted to go in and, you know, make a part or something, I could do that. You know, whatever I want to do, you know, a lot of uh, things that I want to do to my hair, I haven't did to them yet. But that is the final look. That is the comb out. But as you can see, we have moisturized, oiled, crystallized curls. So, that is how you take care of your natural hair. So, um, this video, I just want to make this um, because everybody styles their hair different and everybody has different techniques on how they style their hair. That's fine. I just want to share um, my recipe be with you all because there's more people that I see that have um, tight, coiled hair than loose coiled hair. You know, a lot of the looser coiled hair um, comes in with the biracial mix or, you know, more uh, concentrated Indian or different type of um, features or something. But my hair is a tightly coiled hair. And so, like I said, sometimes I have to use carefree curl on my hair. Um, pink lotion works very well on my hair. But there's... Um, different steps that I have to follow to my hair to maintain my hair but we have now broken the crystals off and and you have a pretty head of hair that's curly the gel has given it definition the moisturizer has moisturized it the oil has sealed um, the moisturizer in so my hair won't be looking dry the the moisture the moisture that I put in there won't be evaporating because we have sealed that in so what I am going to do is put a bonnet on my head to maintain the moisture even more and wake up and style my hair the next day now the next day when I style my hair if I feel like it's dry, I might add, you know, spritz it, add a little bit more water. But you won't need to add any more product because the product is already in there. So when you add uh, water, it will just activate the product or whatever. So I think this um, draws my conclusion of my hair tutorial. You all have my ancient China secret now. So you know how to maintain your hair to keep it 
moisturized looking to keep it healthy to keep it old and conditioned and keep it defined there we are crystallized broken hair so if you like my video please like please share and please subscribe oh and another thing when you are shampooing your hair always use a, a um, when your hair is wet always use a t-shirt if you have an old t-shirt that's more softer because your hair is delicate or um, a microfiber towel is best than just using um, a regular towel because regular towels are dry they are made out of cotton um, I also suggest that you get um, a silk pillowcase to sleep on if you're not going to wear a bonnet to help uh, lock the moisture in your hair but if you have any questions please comment below um, if you have any concerns about how to take care of your hair the next day please comment below um, if you would like to donate to my channel please go about my go to my um, about tab and there you will see uh, my cash app for donations to help make um, your second home cougar's closet a better place so um, I don't know this concludes everything hope you all um, try this and if you do try it and you like the method and it turned out well for you let me know um, if you tried and it didn't work so well for you and you want to know where you went wrong let me know but this concludes my segment of part four of breaking the crystals on your hair and product adding thank you cougar's closet Mwah.